like I said before the weather, I'm Lauren. I'm now joined by Annette from the Breckenridge Recreation Center. How are you this morning? I'm great. How about you? I'm wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. So tell me a little bit about what's going on over at the Rec Center. Well, we got a couple things coming up. We're going to be wrapping up for our closure starting October 3rd. So the Rec Center will be closed the 3rd through the 9th, and then we're doing a bunch of stuff to the pool. So the pool will be closed all of October, so through the 31st. And getting ready for that, we have brought back our pool potty. <laughs> potty. <laughs> so tell me a little bit about what the pool potty is. We're saying that that way on purpose. Yes, because it's P-A-W-T-Y. <laughs> we haven't done this since 2007, wow. and Silverthorne does it, used to do it as well, so there hasn't been one around for a long, long time. So this is our doggy swim, where you can bring your dog out to swim in the fantastic pool at the Breckenridge Rec Center. Um, we're going to have two sessions running on October 2nd. So we have a session at 2 o'clock, a session at 4 o'clock. And uh, so you just need to pre-register. It's a $10 fee, and ha half of the proceeds are going to the one Breckenridge service program here in Breckenridge. Awesome. I feel like um, we talked about the pool party, I think, on Wednesday as well with Bill from the Breckenridge Tourism Office, but he said there's going to be an amateur dock jumping contest, and I was like, I have a little Yorkie that's back in Pennsylvania with my parents right now. I'm like, I wish I just had my little dog. I would just want to see what those little dogs would do. Like, do it'll, I really <laughs> it'll be in the leisure pool, too. So we've got that zero depth entry, so they can just kind of walk on in, which will be great. And then the big crazy dogs in the deep pool. So... <laughs> There, it'll be fun for everybody. We've got, I think we have 44 spaces for each session, but it's going to fill fast. So yeah. definitely register ahead of time, and then we'll collect money at the door. And dogs, of course, have to have um, current vaccinations. Can you come as a spectator, too? Oh, absolutely. Okay. Spectate for free. Oh, great. I'm, I'm going to definitely spectate because I feel like this is going to be a hilarious and really fun event. Um, okay, so we talked a little bit about the pool party. What else is going on over at the rec center? Well, then after closure, we are going to bring back our drop-in fitness passport. And what that is is, well, after closure, we bring out our new fall drop-in fitness schedule. We've got 50 new classes that you can, 50 classes a week that you can take. Wow. So to kind of incentivize people to try to try some new stuff, we've got a passport. You can actually pick up your passport before closure, so you're all ready to go. And then for each different class that you try, you get a stamp. And then whoever has the most different classes will get a free month pass to the rec center or an extension to your current pass. Oh, that is so fun. I should probably get myself in that because I usually just go to body pump. I'll have like a thousand body pumps. Right. Yeah, that's not going to work. <laughs> just check that off a million times. No, no, no. no. Just one time and you got to try it everything. We also have some new um, session-based classes that are fee-based. So we've got some new, new nutrition classes that are actually starting during closure. You get bonus points if you take those classes. So definitely come by and check it out. Cool. So you said there's going to be 50 different classes a week. What are some of the classes that you have over there? Oh, of course, we've still got Zumba. Um, we're going to have so a new, um, what's the new one called? It's called uh, Yo Flow. Oh. So kind of a little spin on a different yoga class. Um, we've got some new instructors coming in, so we'll have cycling. Um, we do Hatha Yoga over at Old Masonic Hall now, which is a drop-in. Um, and we'll bring our classes back to Carter Park, our evening classes at Carter Park. Awesome. Yeah. There's always so much to do over at the yeah. Rec Center. We really, we really blow it out in fall so everybody can, again, get ready for winter and start yeah. building those muscles. Yeah, during <laughs> our mud season, which I don't know if it even exists anymore. I but know. <laughs> I know. Um, cool. So if somebody wants to stop by the Rec Center, if they want to find out more information about all these great activities that are going on, how can they do that? Um, it's all on our website, BreckenridgeRecreation.com, or else come by the Rec Center, um, 880 Airport Road, or give us a call, 970-453-1734. Awesome. Well, Annette, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you. Um, we're going to take a short break, but don't go anywhere because we'll be right back. Mm -hmm. 